Hi everyone. Now, if you recognize this shirt and this look, that means you have watched my previous video. If you don't, then go check that video out so you can see how I did this look. Now, in this video that I'm posting, I'm going to be trying out two things. I'm going to be trying out this lip mask. This one right here is, let me look. This is the Bite Natural Lip Mask. Turn off these lights so that you can see it better. It's a yellow mask. And then I'm also going to be trying out this Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask, which is used to clear pores. Alright, now I'm going to go wash my face and I'll come back so you can watch me apply these. So, be right back. Actually, I decided to bring you guys with me for washing my face. Now what I first do is I just grab a regular old baby wipe and I use it to wipe everything off my face. Start off with the lipstick. And then I move on to the eyes. And then I remove the face. Okay, now that I've wiped everything off, I go in with my face wash, which is Bior uh, Charcoal Deep Pore Charcoal Cleanser. I uh, use this to wash my face. So first what I do after I wipe my face off with the baby wipes, is I get my face wet, I just run, run the sink with water, and I wet my face, and I grab one squirt of this, and I just apply it all over, like so. And then I rinse it off. And then once I do that, I just pat my face dry. Okay, now we're back in my room and we're going to start off with the charcoal mask. It says use once a week or as often as needed. Open pores with warm moist towel and layer on. Allow to dry, rinse well. I did just that before I came back in here. And I have a brush to apply it with. All right, so I just applied this mask, and now I'm going to apply the hydrating light lip mask. All right, so this is a leave-on treatment, so I'm just going to take it out. Oh, oh no, I can open the thing. It doesn't want to get opened, there we go. I'm just going to use my finger and I'm just going to apply it to my, to my lips. This is an agave lip mask, so natural, organic. Hydrating. Go. So, I'm just going to leave this on. It's good. I like how it seems to like immediately hydrate your lips, but stringy gets in my mouth a lot, despite me avoiding trying to get it in my mouth. I'll come back in a little bit to tell you about this mask and how my lips are continuing to feel. 
All right, the mask is beginning to dry a little bit more. It's still wet. It's tightening up really well. I can barely open my mouth past this. As you can tell, this lip mask, I'm absolutely loving. Still, sadly, gets in my mouth. Doesn't taste good. So, still something I don't really appreciate, but it's good. Definitely making my lips soft. Love it. But to me, it seems less like a mask and more like a gloss. But that's just me. Um, I'm going to let this mask finish drying and then I'll come back again. Okay, it's been about five minutes since I last came back and checked in and this mask is taking forever to dry. I wish it would just dry already. Like, come on, every other mask I've used dries within like five to ten minutes. It is going on 15, I believe. Like, come on now. I will check back in again later. Okay, now it's been another 15 minutes. And to me, it seems like it is all dry. Yep, all dry, but it just finished drying. So definitely not a mask to do if you're just wanting to do a real quick mask like most masks it takes about 30 minutes to dry and I did not apply it thick or anything just quick strokes so yeah but it does crack as it dirt like so I mean like most mask face masks that are like this it cracks if you move too much See? Since it's done drying, I don't really care about the crack. So I will go wash this all off. Oh lord. Okay, so I just rinsed it all off. And my face is extremely soft right now. My blackheads seem to mostly be gone on my nose, which was the main problem area for me with my blackheads. Um, my face is soft, like, the difference from where the mask wasn't to where the mask is is insane. Now the lip mask, let me tell you about this lip mask. My face was fully submerged in water, scrubbing my face really hard. Of course I didn't scrub my lips, but it was in water, like, and then I also had the faucet running, so like I was running my face under the water, the stream of the water was coming on my lips, and this mask did not budge. It is all still on, as you can tell by the shine on my lips. So, that's something that I really like about this mask. I'm gonna wipe it off the corner of my mouth real quick. And just feeling it right here, the lip is so much softer. It's not, there's none of the dry skin that was originally there. It's smoother, so my, my lips are hydrated by looking one of these if you can see it's not as chapped as it was before I put it on see not as chapped a lot more hydrated better appearing um, I really like this mask I will definitely invest in it to get the bigger one of it and then I read that they came out with a lip balm for it. I might even test that out and tell you guys how I like it. Oh my gosh, my eyes look so blue right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you for watching this video. And um, like, comment, subscribe. Give me some ideas for my channel. See you later. Bye. Alright, I want to do a quick update about the lip mask that I did last night. Um, just so you know, I'm in a different location, so it's like different background, different lighting, so it's even worse than it usually is, and it's also later than it usually is. So the lip mask, I went to sleep in it, and when I woke up, it was still on my lips, and I put the lip mask on at 11 o'clock, 
and I woke up at 1 p.m. So that that lip mask lasts over 12 hours, and a lot of that time was sleep. Well, okay, well I went to sleep around 4 a.m., but still, that is ridiculous. I love it. I will definitely use it again, and I recommend you do too. All right. Well, like I just said before, like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you want me to do in this channel, and I'll see you later. Bye!